Hello friends, today I am going to tell you about the very important thing in ArcGIS that is the mapping overlay tools. In the geoprocessing tool, these are considered as the mapping overlay tools. So I am going to tell you about this. So for that, I am adding my data. First of all, I am here to perform the buffer part. What is buffer? With the help of buffering tool, we can specify the affected area of that part. This is a shape file of Jammu and Kashmir state. You all know that. I wanted to show here how much area it affect outside the border. So these are the uh, here are the shape file, and I am showing here you the affected part outside it. So for that purpose, I am going to perform here buffering part. For that, I am just going to add my data set input file given the output file as Kashmir buffer save I'm going to here create a buffer of one kilometer and my side will be outside only because I am showing you here the affected area outside so please just ok and here my buffer just done we can see here the difference here you can see clearly the one kilometer buffer area outside the border of Jammu and Kashmir state buffer tool is basically used to see the affected or the surrounded area of a particular features set data set now i am going to perform my second part that is intersection in my previous video i already told you about how to clip with using clip analysis tool you can refer that now i am going to do intersection sorry i am forgot to adding the sample data that is my sample intersection so i wanted to tell you one thing that this is the attribute table of my points these are seven points and containing nothing within it no not a single attribute and this is a single shape file contains the name of the state and the type of the state and length and area now i am going to perform intersection what does the intersection tool do it is an operation analytical operation to select the intersecting part or the overlapping part of two or more feature to extract out the information within it so how do it perform i am given here both the output in sorry both the input and then select here the folder and give it a output kashmir underscore intersection save it and just ok ok here it has been done you can see here ok now in previously I told you about it in the attribute table it contains nothing and now in the intersection file it contains all the information of the another base layer or the another feature data set previously you can see here it contains only the serial number now it contains all the state name uh, state type and because of its point the area and length are constant here so with the help of intersection tool we mainly extract out the information in one file and the intersection part always we can uh, um, done with more than two three features M maximum minimum we need two feature and we can perform here more than two features also third we are going to perform here union what is union this is a sample of some polygons and this is the Kashmir state I am going to perform here union union is simple meaning adding two different feature data set into a single one you can see the sample union is a single data set in a single entity 
and Kashmir is a single entity. And after performing union part, the, both the data set combined together and given output of as a single output, given a single output. Now, um, give the input layers, the output folder and the name union Kashmir union save it and simply click it ok with the help of union tool we will able to combine more than one feature data set again in the sample union the attribute table contains nothing only the id and in Kashmir you can see here only one polygon that contains its name and in the output file it contains all the information of the base layer that is my base layer is Jammu and Kashmir so it contains all the information within it with the help of union file we will we are able to combine more than one feature data set now I am going to again perform one more tool that is the merge tool and lastly I will, I will tell you about the difference between the union and the merge again I am going to given I am given my data set here and the output will be Kashmir merge what is the merge merge is mainly for merging two or more data set into a single one so adding and merging both are the different thing while we add a data we can see the difference between the data visually also but now you can see here the merge option will merge the smaller polygon into the bigger one that is the very important thing but what is the difference between the uh, main file and the merge file the main file attribute contains only one polygon feature and the sample content only three polygon feature and within the merge file we found both the polygon features here we can count total four polygon feature these are the main file this is the main file and these are the smaller file that present within it but uh, x yes these are present within it but we are not able to see it visually the merge option contains the information within the attribute and the four most important thing it is present the different polygon the different three polygons are present within the map but visually it is merged with the main file so we will not able to see it but the information in attribute contains here and in union if we consider the union then the attributes are all the file are not only visually see here but the attributes are also got merged together in union actually it took the main base files attribute within it these are the two difference in merge part the file the different file contains it information in differently both the data set has been merged visually but the attributes are single but in union file all the attributes have been merged together also and here we can see the base layer contain information these are the basic difference of union and merge for today Thank you friends.